Hey guys, it's Kelsey, and I am going to be doing an interesting, different video today. I know my hair is wet. I just got out of the shower, but like I just thought about this, and I was like, I want to do a video on it. Oh, it's all poofy. But anyway, so my channel, my YouTube channel is based off of a gaming, a game. It's a gaming channel based off of RuneScape, and I'm going to be doing something different today because I like to do in real life videos as well. And so this one today is... This may actually some, offend some people, but that's okay. I don't really care. I mean, it's not that bad. It's going to be on gender roles and how it affected me as a kid and even today, but today it's not that big of a deal. Like, whatever. Um, when I was a kid, I was a tomboy, plain and simple. Um, probably from anywhere five and up, I didn't like dolls and the usual stuff I for girls I liked trucks and skateboards and action figures and PlayStation you know I liked all that kind of stuff Star Wars especially and I even liked boy clothing I would wear like cargo shorts and a really thick top t-shirt that like came from the boys section and um, it was just a little weird for me as a kid because I didn't like what other most girls liked. Um, I remember my mom and I would go through the McDonald's drive through and she'd be like, okay, Kelsey, what do you want? And I knew she wasn't asking what I wanted to eat because she knew what I wanted to eat. She wanted to know what toy I wanted. And 98% of the time it was the boy toy. I wanted the boy toy. I didn't want the girl toy. I wanted the boy toy. <laughs> so, um, and that was always really weird for her saying she wanted the boy toy with the Happy Meal, and we pull up, and the people working there would see that she had a daughter uh, who was dressed like a boy. It was really strange, and it's not, has nothing to do with, with gender I liked. You know, it had, it had nothing to do with it. It's just I preferred, um, I didn't like female toys. Like, I didn't want a mirror or makeup or a doll to brush her hair as a toy. I wanted the action figure, the Ben 10 stuff, the, you know, all that kind of stuff I just liked, cars. Um, and that was really odd for me as a kid because it was embarrassing too, like all the girls in elementary school, you know, wore pink short shirts and sometimes dresses and, and things like that. And then there was me, Kelsey, the chick, little girl that looks like a boy. <laughs> um, I always wore my hair in a ponytail, and I still do mostly today. My hair is just wet. Um, and that was really strange. And I guess what my point is, is I don't think that society should really call things boy or man stuff and woman stuff. And I think that we're getting so much better. And I guess better at it. And I guess the reason why I wanted to do this video is my fiance texted me, I'm doing man stuff. And I guess he was working on the car or like fixing the brakes and changing the oil. And I was like, that's not man stuff. I need to know how to do that too. It's just, you're working on the, the car, you know, and women can do that too. Uh, and I just was thinking, cause I guess the only reason why it bothers me is cause when I was a kid, um, I started to really noticed that when I was around 12 years old and going to middle school that I didn't fit in with any of the other girlfriend or girls. Um, I had friends that were girls in um, elementary school, but they knew I was weird too. Um, <laughs> like just not, that was a tomboy. And middle school, like that's when you start to realize that you really like boys as, as a woman. Not everybody, but I did. And um, I wouldn't get the attention from the other boys like some of the girls were getting and I thought maybe I should dress different not because I wanted to I, I could today without being judged by employers or other people I probably would wear male clothing because it's just so much more comfortable than female clothing but you know when you're young you notice that you want attention from boys and things like that sorry my cat's meowing she wants she's in my lap right now but you know it just that wasn't fair as a kid to feel embarrassed for, you know, wanting to go skateboarding. I mean, I was always outside in the cul-de-sac with my bike and um, rip sticking and lightsabers and things like that. You know, I played Battlefront, Spyro, all those things on PlayStation 2. And I started to get into RuneScape, which is primarily what my channel is based on. 
Um, and I don't have an older brother or younger brother or anything like that. I do now. When I was 13, I had a half-brother who was born named Luke. But growing up all the way up to 13, I, I didn't have any siblings. So it's not like I followed my siblings, you know. It's just what I liked better. Um, I remember my dad took me to a football game, and my chin was just busted up. And, like, um, it was just bruised and everything. And I cut because I went on my scooter. I fell and busted my chin because I was always outside playing with my neighbors. And all of them were boys because we had so much in common, you know, and that was when, that was my childhood. And I guess I just wanted to think that, you know, um, today it doesn't seem weird at all when I am play video games or am not as girly as, you know, the rest of the girls. But <laughs> um, I think as a kid it really bothered me. And I thought I was weird and outcasted. When really, that's not the truth. I don't think anyone else cared. The girls thought it was weird. The boys didn't even notice. And the truth is, at the end of the day, people didn't treat me any differently. Um, I guess it was okay. It's just society puts a lot of pressure to do this this way or do this that way. And um, I guess it shows that if you really like something, stick to it no matter what society says. Um, and I don't want this to get political at all. I'm just sharing a personal experience as my childhood and how I kind of went through that weird situation as a tomboy. And I can't even imagine for a boy, you know, a boy liking makeup or dolls probably got would be made much more fun of than a girl. I mean, there's even a word for girls, tomboy, because obviously it's common enough to, for there to be a title on it. But can you imagine young boys and all that pressure to be manly and stuff? It's just kids should be kids and should do what they want. I mean, at that age, you're so innocent. You don't even know. You don't even know what the rest of the world has to offer. You don't know any different. And so anyway, I thought this was an interesting video. And I'm going to uh, post it to my channel. And please please be feel free to make comments and all that. I didn't, I don't mean this to be political at all. I just think that, you know, society is getting better at this. And I definitely think that there shouldn't be a boy or girl section. It should just be, do you want a truck or do you want a doll? You know what I'm saying? It's just preference. So, um Today, I still don't like wearing light colors, like pink, and I always wear dark colors, and I don't know why, I just prefer darker colors. I still wear, I wear light colors, but very rarely, so I guess we all have our preferences, right? Um, anyway, thank you so much for watching, and um, if you're interested in following my channel and my future videos, you can like and subscribe, and just put your notifications on for my channel if you're wanting to see when I post new videos, because some people subscribe and they're like, you haven't posted a new video in forever. I'm like, I don't think you have your notifications on. I love making YouTube videos. So you guys have a great one, and uh, feel free to comment below. Thanks, guys.